Welcome to Until Dawn. The reason it's on Continuum is because I had to check. Um, I did start a recording, but the graphics were trash. I fixed it, so it should run pretty smoothly and look great. So yeah, I haven't played anything. It's just the first cutscene I kind of seen, but not really. In just a few seconds. <laughs> But yeah, this has helped really, that's why Sam isn't in front, but it's the therapist? I don't know what it is. So yeah, welcome to Until Dawn on PC. <laughs> I looked forward to this. I love Until Dawn. It's such a good game. I, oh, I love it. So yeah, let's start a new story. Yes, override, because... yeah. Okay, <laughs> try again. The butterfly effect. A tiny butterfly flapping its wings today may lead to a devastating hurricane in weeks from now. Ooh. And the uh, sound's gonna cut here, I think? <laughs> The smallest decision can dramatically change the future. Your actions will shape how your story unfolds. Ooh. Well, I think uh, <laughs> I messed up my settings. <laughs> your story is one of many possibilities. And I can promise you, uh, choose your actions carefully. I will promise you, I won't look up any guides or anything. I'm gonna play it like how, how I want to play it. Let's see, is it... It's good graphics! Okay, okay, it's still there. Okay, whoo! One of the best horror games ever! And multiple choices games, really. <laughs> I, I like until I love it until dawn. I like the dark pictures anthology. I love the quarry. All of these games are incredible, except for Man of Dawn. That was boring. Oh my god, hate it. <laughs> Ooh. Hello there. That's not ominous at all. <laughs> Hi. Perfect timing. It's snowing there. It'll probably snow within two weeks here. <laughs> Let's just say, it's not the first time it'll snow on Halloween. Hi, what are you doing? <gasps> Whoa! What is this? At moments in the story, you will be under pressure. Using... Thus, the or the left stick to keep the capture inside the boundary. Try it now. Oh! Oops. Uh. Okay. <laughs> so, this is how they will do the don't move thing. I was wondering if I'm not using the PlayStation 4 controller. If you fail to keep inside the boundary, you will draw attention to yourself. Like, this is completely new. I've never seen this. This is not in the original. Oh, okay. No! Oh, oh my god! Okay, this is actually hard. Wow, okay. Okay. My fingers are gonna train. <laughs> Aww. Yeah, and I have a weird font on, <laughs> on the text because I wanted to, and it's dyslexia friendly, apparently. I didn't know that was a thing. But, yeah. Why not, I thought. If it helps someone, then that's nice. Wow. This is so cool. What you doing? Are you gonna Jeez, talk? Josh, there. Once again, brother, you've outdone us all. A 
down a little higher. There we go. This is so weird. This is all completely new. They really did remaster it. Or remade it. I'm unsure. Because in the original, he, he sits at a counter the whole night, pass out drunk. And now his sisters moved him. That's so cool. I'm not gonna spoil anything in this story. If you haven't seen it or anything. <laughs> Hello there! <laughs> but if you know, you know. Oh my god, I can't believe you actually did this. <laughs> Hi. I love her! The one in the background. <laughs> my favorite character, her and him. He turns out great. <laughs> not in the beginning, though. I'm just looking out for my girl M. <laughs> just because he's class prez doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. I am. I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. <laughs> still gonna be creepy <laughs> it's just this one scene in there one of them looks really creepy <laughs> and I'm really curious how they're gonna play that hey he briefly looks at her seriously wow they completely made it <laughs> Well, okay. What's... what's that? Whoa! I can explore already? Let's get back in. <laughs> okay, the game told me to s how to set the settings, but I'm just gonna brighten it a little bit more. Is it here? Yeah, I had to do it up to here because it wasn't 50. No, 25 actually. That's why it looked really bad at the beginning. Where is it? Image sharpening. What's that? Enhances it may affect performance. Let's try taking it up to 50. Just for now. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. And we can just take it back. Ugh. Where is it? Oh, maybe in general. Um, no? Accessibility, maybe? Where is the brightness? I need to brighten it a little bit. It's not in audio, nor controls. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. Okay, we're just gonna be in the dark. Maybe we can change it later if it really is bad. Ooh. And it kind of looks like a movie the entire time. That's hey, really cool. Did you see that? Dad said it'd just be us this weekend. Josh. Oh yeah, the, the camera! It's so weird! Again, like it's in a movie, we can't really move the camera that much. Except for certain points, like here. Now it's me. It's over here. Oh, I can't wait for Life is Strange 2, too. It's... Woo. 
It's been fun hanging out with you. No one gets me like you do. Come find me later. I'll be waiting. Mike. Oh my god. What did our naive sister get herself into now? Oh. Is she gonna change? Is there supposed to be music here? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, it's supposed to be music here. I can see it. I'm gonna try to get some music here too. Whoa! Oh, that was cool! Ooh, writing in her diary. Nice tattoo. I want a tattoo, but I don't know what it's gonna be like. Okay, these trans transitions are really cool. I love them. They're really creative. Yeah, look, her, how she's hiding, it's so creepy. I'm so curious about what the music is. Under the bed, it looks like. And she's ready. Oh no. Oh. He looks nervous. <laughs> Hey, Hannah. Oh. I got your note. Glad you could make it. Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Just a Whoa! Okay. Uh, I'm sorry, Hannah. This all got out of hand. Uh, Mike! Damn. Uh, you guys are jerks. You know that? Hannah! Whoa, 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 whoa. Dude, it's freezing outside. Find others, awake Josh. Well, he's passed out cold, so let's find the others. Yes, yes. Oh, okay. Ooh. Stats update. What? Nothing of it. Oh, she's higher on her curiosity level. I'm sorry, I love these. I love watching them go up and down, how their relationships are affected. This is... Oh! Such a good game. Hannah! What's going on? Where's she going? It's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was... It's just a prank, Ham! <laughs> what did you do? Oh, it's a classic. It wasn't serious. You jerk! So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Yeah. <laughs> you guys made her almost take her shirt off. Hey. On video. That's horrible. Oh. Okay. Oh my god! Okay. Wow. Oh. Hannah! Hannah! Where are you? Oh. 
There we go. <laughs> Whoa, 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 okay. Let's hope it works out here. Whoa, what's that? <gasps> oh, shit. They've had the new things here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, we need to fix that. I'm so sorry, but we want it to be the best we can, right? So let's um, not this one. It was the image sharpening one. Yes, let's take that down to 30, I think. I think that should be good. Oh! Hey, the deer! It's a little weird still. I'm sorry, I just want it to be the best. I don't want it to be bad, right? Let's take it down to 150. It's not that much different. Okay, that helped, that helped. Let's see if we, if we can find her. Is that her? Really, I'm going into this completely blind. I remember the story, but they have changed so much here. It's so weird. Oh, I have to hold it. <laughs> I, think, I think it's a cutscene. <laughs> Hannah? Don't, don't. Am I supposed to? Oh my god, what? What? What the? Oh my god! Oh shit, quick time! Uh, do the fast one. Woo! There's a dragon here. <laughs> um. Oh, what should we do? Uh, footprints. I have to. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, she's braver. That's cool. Come on, come on. Oh my god. Huh? Jesus. Fuck. Shit. <laughs> yeah. Damn it, Hannah. Where are you? <gasps> oh, there she is. Hannah. Okay. Hannah. She found her. No, no, no. You're not dumb. You're an idiot, but you're not dumb. <laughs> run, 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 run. Okay. <laughs> Her face turned black. <laughs> oh, 
Let go. We can't drop our sister. <gasps> what would have happened if he hadn't done anything? Ouch. Ooh! Oh, sorry. I got the trophy. <laughs> oh, Dr. AJ Hill. Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. Okay. You see, no one can change what happened last year. Of course. The past is beyond our control. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open the <laughs> I'm sorry. the future. <laughs> I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. Great. Whoa, whoa, dude. Get away from so, the screen. You have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right. We will start with a simple exercise. Okay. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. I'm supposed to feel okay. Hmm. Yeah, it makes me happy, honestly. Well, that's good. In what way did it make you happy? It's peaceful. That's the thing. Well, Interesting. It's interesting. So, would it make you happy to spend the whole week here all by yourself? That I have to think about. Uh, I do enjoy solitude. A place peaceful. Oh, I'm kind of torn. If I can bring a dog. Sure. Dogs don't count, I think, so, yeah. And what if I told you that this cottage was haunted? <laughs> I wouldn't really care, honestly. But uh, I'm really paranoid. I'd be scared, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> I wouldn't care, but I would be scared. Oh, Come look at the brain of me. Beyond the veil of death is after all ultimate unknown and what could inspire fear more than the terror of uncertainty oh i'm sorry we're out of time oh i wanted more questions <laughs> I, I like these the spot on his sleeve i can't look away from it Hey, he's like me! <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no, no, I don't, I don't want to be like you. <laughs> oh? <laughs> and it stopped. <laughs> Copyrighted music. <laughs> Hayden uh, Penetier. Oh, I really like this intro. Ella Latini. Rummy Malek. Oh, I heard his name before. 
No Flies, Galandriel Steinman, Jordan Fisher, Jordan Fisher, I knew I recognized them. Nicole Sakura, Brett Dalton. <laughs> I need to turn this down there. <laughs> Megan Mar Martin. Hey, a doggy! Larry Fessenden. Peter Stormer. Okay. It's a nice song, though. A little creepy. I like it. Oh, I really like that. I think that's new. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a oh. person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Well, thank you for joining us, Anne. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. I thought that was right. real life. Oh. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. Ah! Yeah! So, uh, <laughs> let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this, and that uh, I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, you know, thinking of them. Yeah. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and, um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for... For the sake of my sisters and you know okay so let's party like we're fucking porn stars his okay, name is right? Rami Malek right never forget, all right I think that's what it said yes. <laughs> where have I seen them and Jordan Fisher he's isn't he the face of one of the guys at the quarry I, I don't know it looks like him Mento Mori chapter one ten hours until dawn <laughs> okay. I look forward to this. Blackwood Pines. Ooh, you're back. I hope there are, there are a lot of new things in this game. I really hope so. That would be so fun. Sam! Hannah's best friend, diligent, considerate, and brave. My favorite character. Really like her. Hello? Someone there? Hmm. Path to cable car station. Ooh. Someone's walked here. Oh, this is this is gonna be awesome. I'm just saying it. This is gonna be awesome. A bird. 
I'm gonna lose my voice. <laughs> what is this thing? Oh, what? The gate's best to climb over, Chris. Josh Washington to Chris. Ooh. Vancouver Central, yeah, yeah, yeah. Change the terminus, then take that, blah, 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 blah. Um. Um. Okay. <laughs> I can do it. Okay. Oh, it works pressing E. Let's do it quick. That's fun. I've trained after playing FNAF, so I'm good at quick time. What did I say? <laughs> I'm better at that uh, on a controller. But I want to try to play on the keyboard. So be more familiarized with it. Because controllers are muscle memory. I played my whole life on a controller. PlayStation, particularly. The Xbox, the Xbox controller can confuse me. Because it has an X there too, but it's on the wrong place. <laughs> A squirrel! Aww. Hey little fella. Fella? <laughs> huh? Okay, do not scare the squirrel! <laughs> yes! Kitty. Yeah. Bloody! Oh, such a kitty. I'm happy that happened. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> ooh, ooh. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just so oh, I'm full of energy because I'm so happy about this game. Just came out. Okay. Indigenous people and butterfly prophecies. Tribes who once lived in these mountains believe the butterflies they carry dreams and prophecies of possible futures. The color of the butterfly indicated the nature of the prophecy. Death. Black butterflies uh, prophesied, uh, prophesied in dreamers' death. Danger. Red butterflies uh, warned of dangerous events. Loss. Brown butterflies foretold of tragedy afflicting, affecting friends. I can't scroll down. Whatever. Um, fortune. White butterflies that brought, brought dreams are looking good fortune. What does it say at last? Come on! Oh, that's the color on the mouse. Where's the rainbow? Wrong, wrong, wrong. There we go, okay. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> But now, okay, how do I do it? Controls, keyboard settings. For a mouse, sure. Um, okay, it's, where is it? Ah. Uh. Hmm. Well, that sucks. Okay, okay, um. I'm sorry, I'm not going to do that more times today. There! I can use the the arrows. Okay. Fortune it is. Wait. Huh? Oh, I'm not supposed to read that one. Um. Did I read these? <laughs> Um, if not, you you have probably read them by now. Whoops, wrong button. 
Let's <laughs> let's just pretend. <laughs> that confused me. So around here. Hello, Chris. Chris. Hello. <laughs> Sorry. Ooh, wanted. Clue found. Ooh. Malgrum Victor, male six uh, six two. Or as I know it, 188 meters. <laughs> 188 centimeters, really. Uh, uh, Blackwood Pines, last seen in 1998, okay. Wounded in connection with a first degree arson offense as well as various death threats. Anyone with information regarding this dangerous criminal should con contact the BPMC as, as soon as possible. Blackwood Provincial Mounted uh, Constabulary, Police uh, Monte Provincial in uh, the Blackwood, July 1998. Oh, wrong one. <laughs> cool. What's back here? We need to explore and find clues. What's this? Oh. Hey there. Nothing. Okay. Oh, those sounds, it's so cool. Nothing. Okay. Can you walk faster, Sam? No? Okay. That's fine. I haven't learned yet. What's over there? Because I think we have to go in there to continue, so let's look around first. Whoa! Here's some tracks. The past is beyond our control. Ooh. Now, what's up here? Ooh, a car. Two cars. Ooh. I can look at it. Booty call? <laughs> Emily! <laughs> it's just a prank, Ham! That girl. Her name's Emily. Okay, so she's here. There are multiple cars, so she's not the only one. I probably can't go that way. Some trash. What's this? Oh, is this a totem? Yes! Search the totem to locate the premonition. Ooh. That's different. It's probably here. There it is. Whoa. Guidance totem. Let's look at it. Ooh, mystery man. Yes, uh, the clue. Totems. <gasps> Indigenous tribes uh, believe that uh, butterflies uh, brought dreams and premonitions. Each totem piece foretells a possible future event. How you play will determine whether or not these prophecies come true. As you unlock totems, the events of the past will become clear. So we just got this one. Yellow Butterflies offers visions to help and guide people. So something to do with a bird. Oh, hunger! Hunger? Seriously? Cool. Wow, look at this. The twins, 1952. Mystery Man, Butterfly Effect. Oh. And then there's the status of the character we play as. Which well, is pretty neutral with everyone. Mike and Jazz a little lower than the others. That's interesting. I saw on Beth's thing that her and, and Sam were pretty high, and I'm guessing her was pretty high with Hannah too, since they were best friends. I hope so, at least. And she's brave and charitable, mostly, and uh, really honest, but not that romantic, funny, or and a little bit curious. Interesting. But yeah, yeah, let's um, get going then. <laughs> Honestly, this is a new area, I think. I can I cannot 
remember this place over here. Just here, as soon as we come here, there is a cutscene in the original. So that's... Oh, I love it! I love new things! <laughs> Bag, are you? Hello, what do we have here? Ooh, snoop or closed bag. Well, I can already see that it's someone called Ash, so we don't need to snoop. <laughs> Congress stuff. Sam is a good person, okay? Ooh. Any of your business. Sam respected Chris's privacy. Cool. Chris. Sam, hey, you made it. Chris has a crush on Ashley. Loyal, protective, humorous. Oh, so I found something kind of amazing. What? <laughs> I didn't mean it. See for yourself. Come on. We're twins. <laughs> Where? Right around here. Gonna blow your mind. Are you gonna look at the gun range? Because I saw the rifle there. Ta da! Pretty rad, right? Rad? Yeah! <laughs> Come on, look at these beauties! Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. No. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. <laughs> I don't know who that is. You go ahead, Grizzly. <laughs> All right. Here goes. Okay, Chris, show us what you can do. Oh, I'm him. I'm the target in the shooting range. Oh! More! <laughs> Yeah. Am I good or what? All right. I'm bad. I'm badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. No, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. <laughs> Squirrel! I love that sound. <laughs> I'm not gonna shoot it. Hello. I'm not a murderer. Nice shot. Your ass just got sacked. <laughs> hey, sharpshooter, a ride's coming. Sorry. <laughs> I need to see. Oh, he's closer to Sam. A little bit. It just went up. He is really close to Josh and Ashley. Not so much the other ones, but Sam just got a little higher. He's curious, really curious. He's funny and charitable. Pretty honest, not so very brave, and a little bit romantic. Probably because he has a crush. <laughs> Ooh, rats with a bushy ta with bushy tails. Chris chose not to not to shoot the squirrel. Wait, oh. I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Crow! Oh. oh, it's 7 11. <laughs> 7 11. <laughs> I'm sorry, I know that's not that funny, but. Oh, I'm so happy they have those clocks. I understand those. Coming back up here after a whole year. Yeah, I swear the moment I got here, it just. Oh, oh yeah, that's weird. sorry, what? <laughs> yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. You said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. Yep. Now that's life. Whoa! Oh, a snowboard! I cannot snowboard. I hate skiing. I hate all inventory activities, really. Except for Christmas activities. What's that? <laughs> what the hell? Why would I care about Britney Spears? 
Guess we gotta wait. I'm starting to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. Yeah. How long is this gonna take? It's a big mountain. Yeah. Back, 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 back. What a crazy place to set up house. Tell them the sanatorium. <laughs> Only. What's other things are here? What's this? What the? Is that a bath? Huh. That's weird. What's any more things here? No. Whoa. Just look at that beautiful place. I was gonna stay here and catch some bees, but okay. I'm gonna let them talk and then I'm gonna share a story. Oh, forget it. Okay, I have a funny story. Um, when I was working in a stable, if you know, you know, um, I, I had to drive over a mountain to get home. Sleeping giant. And yeah, one time while I was driving on this road, I kind of like zoned out. Not what you're supposed to do when you're driving, by the way, that's dangerous. But I, I'd driven that road several times, so I disappeared yeah I know you said it and I just looked at the mountain while I was driving completely zoned out and I was just thinking wow that's good graphic it looks so real <laughs> I thought I was looking at, a TV, at my TV <laughs> I felt so stupid I realized right away but just whoa <laughs> no <laughs> I find that story yeah. real funny. Right. Adventure begins. Oh, this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. Sure. He seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no. He definitely did. I, I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good. Good. It's hard to tell with him, and I you know, kind of been worried. No, no. It was it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. Mm -hmm. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Yeah. Uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room. I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front. I was sitting. Okay, so... So, I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. Cool. Josh made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that <laughs> decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her training bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Boom. Butterfly effect. Butterfly effect. <laughs> also iconic. What happens now? Whoa! Um, she doesn't have a head! <laughs> <No>! <laughs> Just Mike's girlfriend. Outgoing, driven, and impulsive. <laughs> oh my god. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Early games, perfect. Time to meet and greet. <laughs> I hope the next person we see have their head. <laughs> like Hannah's uh, became black, and her was completely gone. I know my thumb thumbnail. <laughs> I saw him. Hey. Jessica, over here. Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? Oh my god. I thought we were gone. 
corners. Another ten minutes in there, and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, <laughs> got a lot of meat on my bones. This is all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey. <laughs> well, well, well. What do we have Chris. here? My goodness. Ooh. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Explain. Mike and M split. We're together. Whoa. I'm sorry. I'm obsessed with this. Oh? Huh? She's really honest, really romantic and funny, a little brave, a little bit curious and not so charitable. <laughs> oh, she's not that fun of Sam? But she just grew closer to Chris. That's so interesting. Why did she go down with Sam? Was it because she, they scared her? Interesting. Not really. It's pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Huh. All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys <laughs> go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. Let's see who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? <laughs> I mean, you know, whoever. Uh huh. Sam. <gasps> Did you see this wow. Thing? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. That's beautiful. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge like oh. right where the cable car ends? Emily, Matt's girlfriend. Intelligent, resourceful, forthright. I don't think it would have been like as pretty. They have know. heads. They have heads. Matt, Emily's boyfriend. Obliging, dependable, active. Obliging. <laughs> okay. And where's the Kinda like me. boy when you need one? Okay, before anything happens, we're gonna look at his statuses. He's honest, charitable. Romantic here he is, a little bit brave and a little bit funny. His relationships are he's closest with Emily and Jess. Hmm. Not so much with uh, Josh, Mike, or Chris. A little bit Ashley and Sam, but not really. Okay. Is there anything behind us? We're almost there. No, I mean getting kind of creeped out. Oh. No, nothing. Okay. Yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. Definitely Must be. Feel like a regular party. Hmm. I mean, what do you think? Oh, Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> Hello there, Mike. Jess's boyfriend. Brave, driven, and charismatic. <laughs> you guys. Michael. You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> <laughs> Look like it. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. Go up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. Yeah, it's spirit? almost Halloween. Seriously, what's wrong with Four you, weeks away. <laughs> just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like or what? three. The way you're being, you always get like this. Uh, let's be nice. Michael. Oh, does she hate us now? Yeah, she did not like that, but he's more charitable. That's good. I'm just gonna lay it out, otherwise this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just, uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Nah. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. So we're good? All good? You guys good. gonna make out now? Oh, sure! Wow, totally, we're so gonna make out. <laughs> uh, no, seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back down the trail. Alright, see you, man. See ya. Alright, see ya! <laughs> I like Mike. Oh, crap. What? What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. 
Why? Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. Okay. All right. Fine. It's obliging. Let's be obliging. Oh, romantic went up, and we're back with Emily. Okay. <laughs> she liked it. It's so important. I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. But you owe me one. Excuse me? Well, then we're even, at least. I'll think about it. <laughs> oh, my God. See you up there, sweetie. Thank you. <laughs> it's nice to we're getting to be introduced to all the characters. That's nice. They did remove the creepy scene with her. Ashley has a crush on Chris. Academic, inquisitive, sensitive. Whoa! Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. They're not in the friend zone kind of way. Really? I don't see it. Check the expiration date on their big breakup. I just... It looks like they're just talking, really. They don't look like they're into each other or anything. Where they placing their hands are a little weird. Oh! oh bitch! Hey, hey. hey whoa. Oh. <laughs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hey, wow. Man, I'm not really sorry, Ash. Damn. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it... Let me check it out. No. Um... You don't want to look, yeah, it's really. Kind of busted. It's not. It's not like really interesting. It's just. I'm like, sorry. I have to. Oh, she's not honest anymore. Oh, but Matt uh, didn't change though, so that's good. What? For real? I, I bet I could find like a cool bear chowing down on a fox or something. No, no. No, really, Matt. It's not worth straining your eyes. I'm getting kind of a headache just from looking through it. So just no. Ooh, butterfly effect. Any of your business is updated. Sam respected Chris's privacy. Chris was happy to see Sam. Chris continued to trust Sam. <gasps> Whoa! Oh! New pictures? Okay. I remember we had to kind of like you know, switch pages on the butterfly wings to see these. So this is new. This is also updated. Chris did not shoot the squirrel. Nature remained in balance. Whoa! What? Ooh, the solo discretion. Actually, discouraged Matt from using the telescope. No. All right. Uh, sure, if you say so. Ooh. But it wasn't really anything interesting. They didn't look too friendly, honestly. Just some weird hand gestures, but that's it. <laughs> it wasn't that a big deal, I think. Uh, what should she do? Uh, she's not like me. She can look at her phone. What's this? Oh, she's curious. Um, she's honest. A little f funny, romantic. Curious. A l kind of brave and not so charitable. Did we look at this before? I think so. What happened here? Oh, Matt didn't see it. Mike and Emily flirting. They weren't flirting. They were just talking. I think. I think so. Oh, you did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. <laughs> the hell am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? That's a grub of noble. I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> hey! Oh. Boom! Great. 
Hey, you know that? Where are you hiding, little chickadee? Go! Oh, ah! I... Hey! Ow! Oh! Oh! Must have heard. I press D and not A. Hello. Come on. <laughs> hey, Mike. Boom! Okay. Now you got me. Fair enough. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Snowball fights are found. Sometimes doing nothing is the right thing you to can't do. Hide from me, Michael. I know all your tricks. I'm not hitting a bird. I'm not hitting a bird. Boom. Wow. Right. Find you just. And then what? Oh, oh. no more. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> gotcha. It's done. Done city. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor, then? You're a worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Everything sounds dirty to you, I think. <laughs> ah. <laughs> I need to see. Hey! Yeah, it's not really different, but she's more funny and brave. That's great. That makes her good. Oh, okay. Okay, you're really gonna get it. What am I gonna get? Well, I can think of it at least. I'm oh, sorry. But you'll have to wait until later. We should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. <laughs> I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. <laughs> Just making out? We did say everything's dirty to her. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. Ooh. What's that? Whoa, whoa, there's a person in there! Ooh. Hey! Hello again. And how are we feeling? Hmm? Pretty good. I've had a fun time. In our last session, we established that you have a fear of things. That are dead or undead. Did we? Yeah, kind of. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Please do. I have no idea. Turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Men it scares the frick out of me. Oh, both of these scare me, really. I'm not that much on planes, so I'll go with crowds. Too much of it isn't good. I like heights. Drowning, I hate water. <laughs> Hmm. I'm not scared of snakes, really. I know as long as you keep distance from them, you're fine. And there aren't snakes where I live. <laughs> but I do like watching them in these zoos around, where they live a nice life, not those bad zoos, but conservation zoos. I've talked about that before. I really like snakes. They're really cool. I've, I've caught so many rodents. And toads in boxes. So I can set them free. So I'm not really scared, but they do startle me. So let's just go with rats. I'm not scared of snakes. I have real huge respect for snakes, but I'm not scared. Ooh. 
Mm, I guess guns. But I don't have experience, luckily. Oh, definitely cockroaches. <laughs> I'm glad I don't live here. <laughs> it's too cold. Ew. 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 I don't like either of them. Clowns. Take a book from my friend. Crows are scary, but gore do disgust me a little bit. Not that much. Whoa! Hey! Did I startle you? Not really, but you're. You're doing very well. You disappoint me. Can I continue? Ooh. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Okay. <laughs> Let's be fast. Lightning round. Spiders! Hate spiders. I like needles. <laughs> Happy now? I know what to do with zombies, but clowns, they can be smart. Zombies are stupid. I love wolves and dogs, so no. Nope. Gore. Storms do scare me a little bit. Oh, was that it? I wanted to do that more. Thank you for answering so diligent. Diligently? Spiders, clowns, and thunderstorms. The sun combination sounds like a good Friday night. Uh, it's Saturday. <laughs> uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hmm? Well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. I hope so. I like these sessions. Okay. Is that it? What's happening? Ooh, chapter two. Okay, I guess we're gonna quit from here. We'll do a chapter two next time. I don't have any more time left. Uh, it's a quarter to ten in the evening. And I want to eat some popcorn. <laughs> so, but yeah, this is a great start. Um, I'm done with playing with the settings, so from now on it's gonna be pretty smooth. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed getting to know the characters and stuff. And um, well, if you liked the video, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.